and welcome back to my channel. Um, I just wanted to kind of do like an update type video today. I've never done a video like this before so I thought I would. It will probably only be a few minutes but I just thought I would update you guys just about what's going on in my life as of now. So um, first of all, I'm just checking down on my notebook because I just wrote like little bullets that I wanted to talk about. But as of now, in exactly three weeks from today, I will be back at work. <laughs> um, as most of you guys probably know, I work at a school on the TA. And I go back, when you guys see this video, it'll be obviously even less than that. But when I'm filming this, it'll be three weeks of today that I have to go back to work. So, I mean, I am looking forward to it. I love going back after having the summer off but then it's like you want another break and I don't know but I am going back I'm going to be working in special ed this year I was working with AIS last year so same position just I'm just a little bit like different class so that's what I'm doing and that's what I'm up to I also coach Odyssey of the Mind so when I get back to work I'm going to be pretty busy. I'm going to be coaching two different OM teams when I go back so on Tuesdays and Thursdays I'm going to be coaching and then obviously working every day and then babysitting on the side and stuff like that so I'll go back and I'm going to be super busy but I'm going to try to continue to make as many videos as I can. I try to leave the weekends pretty open that way I have a time to relax and do what I want to do. That's about it for work I believe. Um, oh, one thing I wanted to talk about was starting to make just like a few crime videos here and there. I love crime channels, I love crime podcasts, books, um, I'm not, I don't love reading about true crime. I've read one true crime book about the Golden State Killer, but I listen to so many podcasts. I've watched different documentaries on TV about true crime, um, I, like I said, podcasts, YouTube videos documentaries I do my own research so I figured since like I'm so obsessed with doing this type of stuff that I might as well make some videos about it because that's really what I do enjoy so I might just do them like here and there maybe once I get back to work and I get more of like a schedule I'll do certain days I'll do crime like certain days I'll do vlogs certain days I'll do like sit down videos and that type of stuff that way I can be like on an actual schedule but in the summer I just feel like I'm not on any type of schedule at all so I'm not even going to try and do that and like I said summer is almost over anyway for me it's August 15th right now when I'm filming it so summer is pretty much over but I would love to do some true crime videos or like mystery type things on my channel just to make it you know switch it up a little make it a little interesting that way it has like different types of videos on here like lifestyle type videos and then I can have like my crime videos and stuff like that so let me know what you guys think I think my first case I'm going to do is the Peterson case I just listened to a podcast on that and I watched the um, documentary that is on Hulu I'm not quite done with it yet so I want to finish it up and do some research of my own before I film the video. That way I have like everything correct and all of my facts straight before I put it on the internet. Another update is just this channel in general. As you guys have maybe noticed, um, it's only been me uploading. And that's because Shy already had had a YouTube channel. And um, then we decided to make the group one, but she's gonna go back to her original channel that she had. I'll link it down below. Nothing happened between me and Shy or anything like that. We're still really good friends. She was just over my house like two days ago for dinner, and nothing happened with that. She just wanted to do her own, and I'm going to do my own. So that's what's going on in this channel. It's going to be mostly me. <laughs> From now on, obviously I'm going to have like vlogs with everybody in them and everything, but I will be the one posting on this channel. So like I said, I'll link Shai's channel down below. She's had it for a few years now, but when we were doing this channel together, she wasn't really posting on it, but she is starting to again. So as of this October, we will be one year out from my wedding. Um, so 
I don't know if I'm going to do more wedding videos. I don't know what type of wedding videos to do. I've already done most of my shopping and most of my planning. I have yet to get a dress. I mean, I could do a vlog going to look at dresses and stuff and bridesmaid dresses, but I obviously wouldn't be able to show the dress that I choose and stuff like that. But I don't know what type of wedding videos to really post. Like I said, I have most of the wedding stuff done that I did last year. Um, we are going to be doing our bachelor and bachelorette party in the spring because we want to go to Vegas and we don't want to go in Vegas in the summer when it's super hot out. So I think we're going to do that in the spring. So obviously I would have a vlog if we did that and stuff like that. But I don't know what type of wedding videos to do. Maybe I'll look up some type of wedding video I can film or like a tag or something just, you know, because it's fun to do. But like I said, this is going to be a pretty short video because I don't have many updates, but I just wanted to let you guys know like what is going on in my life. Um, trying to think what else. Hmm. We've been living in our house for um, five, yeah, a good five months now, just five months. We moved in, I think it was March 12th was our closing date. And like I said, it's August 15th. So we've been in the house for five months now and it's a lot of work, but we love it. We enjoy it. Um, I love having my own house to come home to, like my own room to come film in, and I don't know, it's like the best feeling. Like I said, it is a lot of work, there's always something to do, like always something to fix, always something to buy, but I really do enjoy having my own house in my own little neighborhood. I really do like it, and in the summer, I only babysit twice a week on Tuesday and Thursdays. I pick up kids from summer camp. There's two kids I babysit, so I pick them up from summer camp. I go to their house, like we go out and do stuff, whatever. So that's what I've been doing in the summer. Um, if you watch my vlogs, you would know that, but I have only one more week left of that. It's Thursday right now, so I just got back from babysitting. And then I have one more week, and then they go away, and then we start school, so. I can't believe that it's almost over. Summer flew by so quick this year. I think like I said, like just having my own house and just constantly having something to do. I didn't really have time to be that bored this summer. So it went by super, super quick. But um, look forward to some crime videos and fall vlog videos. I feel like those are my favorite to do because there's so much fun. There's so much stuff you can do in fall in upstate New York. So. Um, I am excited for that, even though that means summer's ending. Summer is my favorite season ever, but so look forward to all that stuff. If you have like any true crime cases you want me to do a video on, please comment them down below and I would love to. Um, there's like a few that I like really, really know about, but obviously I can do the research and watch shows and read up about them. I literally love to do stuff like that, so let me know down below if there's any cases that you want to see, but I think I'm going to start with the Peterson case, because like I said, that one's like newest in my memory, so I might start with that one, so we'll see. I hope you guys enjoyed this little update, and I will see you guys in my next video.